Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy No Feelings here with another full guide tutorial video and in today's video I'll be showing you how you can do the frozen money glitch using Save Wizard guys. This will be the full guide tutorial. Now once you have your Save Wizard PS4 Max open, what you need to do, go into your profile, open up advanced mode and once advanced mode opens up, you will need to then insert the modded file i will leave that in my description the frozen money save file i will leave that in my description so now you will hit apply and you will hit yes and once all the files are fully completed guys let it download the save once it's done downloading the save We'll head straight into the PS4. Okay, there you go, guys. So you just want to hit OK after all files have been completed in the transfer now you want to just eject your usb from storage and head straight over to the ps4 okay guys once you make it back to the ps4 what you need to do head over to settings go over to application save data management go over to save data on usb storage and copy the files to the system storage apply to all hit yes once you have done that you will head straight into your grand theft auto file and once you fully loaded into your grand theft auto 5 you want to load into that game save that same game save that you did bring on in the game once you've loaded into it, I'll show you what you need to do next, guys. This is what the modded save look like. You just want to open up your pause menu, go over to online, play GTA online, go over to invite only session and just load it up. And when you get inside, I'll let you know what you need to do next. guys so, so once you've made it inside the lobby the invite lobby what you need to do go over to online and leave gta online that's all you need to do leave gta online as soon as you, en you enter the invite only lobby you just want to leave gta online it will then bring you back to story mode okay guys so once you made it inside like this you want to enter the spawn buzzer cheat code i will leave that in my description make your way over to the LS custom down by the this airport. This is the easiest way you could make your way there guys. I'll leave that cheat code in my description. Everything will be in the description. You just want to make your way over to the LS custom. Right here guys. You just want to make your way over here. Now once you've made your way over here guys by the LS custom your way to the back of the ls customs follow all my steps guys and you will hit this glitch 100 percent so you want to go in between the forklift and these steel and you will see the peyote plant you want to hit right on the d-pad for you to hit the peyote plant and then your screen will then flash to white now you have to wait until you spawn as the animal guys and you will see franklin running away from the animal I'll let you know what you need to do. Okay guys, I've spawned as the animal. Sometimes the character will run away like this. That's not a problem. All you have to do is wait 5 seconds or 6 seconds. And you just want to hit right on the D-pad. So you could just wait 5 to 10 seconds guys. And hit right on the D-pad. Now your screen will flash to white like this then wait guys this is the technical part people open their pause menu but you have to wait till you see 
your character in between the flashing screen guys so just like this you want to open your pause menu that's when you do it head over to friends and you want to have your friend online in a public lobby where you can inspect it you want to inspect it don't do anything just wait there until it disappears go back to online go over to play gta online go get over over close friend session and you just want to spam all your way through, through guys like once you're over over close friend session you just want to spam x all the way through until you go through the screen like this this is the, the technical part guys you just need to spam x as quickly as you can while you're hovered over close friend session so that way you'll accept all the alerts to join your friend and all of that in the background so right here guys you can see I will be joining GTA online another trick guys you will see here in a second the screen will change once it changes like this like this guys you will see it turn to blue like this that's how you know you're joining GTA online and you did hit the glitch right guys I mean took a few tries for me to master this guys and know how you are able to do it and when you are doing it right so there you go you will see me then spectate in my friend you will see GTA online like this you will see this logo then you will see you are spectating your friend in the lobby this is so back out guys O, back out accept the alert quick spectator mode then it will loan to then load you into another public online lobby guys so here we go we're loading into the lobby i'll show you what you need to do next okay guys now we're loading in there we go once we have loaded in our character will load in as a default character looking like this with the checkered shoes and the headphones and basically this equipment right here so what you need to do to make sure that you are in frozen money although that i know you are once you reach this part of the glitch you just still want to go into your ammo purchase some ammo so you can make sure your money doesn't move like this guys my money doesn't move i'm in frozen money and what you need to do you could just close out your interaction menu open up your phone go into internet browser head over to warstock cash and carry and you want to go over to deluxos this is the fun part guys this is where you get the money <laughs> this is where you get the cheddar the cheese all right then you want to purchase your deluxos and put them in any garage guys any empty garage i have many cars so i right now i'm being selective in which garages that i'm putting them in as you can see i will now just replace my lg and put my deluxo in there so that's all you have to do just keep buying deluxos guys and just full up all your apartments remember your apartments that you did purchase the deluxos because it will be important for the next part after you're done here guys i'll show you exactly what you need to do follow my steps you will be 100 percent successful in doing this glitch guys so now i will make my purchase Right now, I'm just fooling up one of my garages. Take note of the garage that I am fooling it up, guys. All right, there you go. So what you need to do once you're done making your purchases is open your interaction menu and change your outfit to force a save. Then you want to head down to leave GTA online. That's what you need to do. Head down to G leave GTA online. Go over the online. Go over leave gta online to then pull you back into story mode I'll show you what you need to do next you will spawn like this you might be falling through the map like this once you reach back on top of the map you just need to keep spamming the, the pause menu until you get it open quickly go over to play gta online and load in an invite lobby guys I just want to do this part very quick so you don't run into any errors guys and 
once you've loaded into that invite lobby, I'll show you what you need to do next. Alright guys, I've loaded in. I'll just make my way to the garage that I made the purchases of the deluxe suit. Okay guys, so I've made it to the garage. I will now enter the garage. Show you what you need to do so you can completely save these vehicles guys this is the most important part after you've done all the other steps this is the most important part so there you go is you're seeing all the deluxe that i did purchase then you want to go to the blue marker hit right on the d-pad so you can just switch each positions of the deluxe guys you just want to rotate them around the garage you just want to rotate them around the garage like this you just keep you just keep switching them around like this that way you'll force a save on them and you could just have them in your, your garage for when you're ready to sell them and they will sell for 2.8 million dollars plus change each so after you're done make a, a save on your outfit go over to online and go into creator mode so that way you can then do the next step guys i'll show you what you need to do next Once you load into creator mode, you can then close your application. Now, the third most important step, you want to load back into the game, guys. And after you've seen the pretty lady like this, you want after she disappears, you just want to hold R1. Hold down R1 on your controller. Keep holding it, guys, until you get that display calibration. So that way, that way you could clear your cache and you could load back into an any lobby guys you could just if you don't clear your cache you won't be able to load back into any public lobby you won't even know, be able to load back into an invite lobby you have to clear your cache so that's the important part all right guys if you did enjoy the video please drop a like and subscribe so you never miss out on my daily videos and my future gift cards to friends and there you go guys <laughs> that's it that's how you do the frozen money i hope i've been a helpful guide and if i did subscribe to me so you never miss out guys it's your boy